Hi, it's Mark Coleman from Paul's Photo, the lab at Paul's Photo and the Creative Photo Academy. Happy Saturday. It's day 225 of our Be Creative series. And I'm so lucky at Paul's Photo sometimes we get really cool trade-ins. We got this used Leica 3 that has the black leather peeled off. So it looks, it's all silver and white and it's so unique. So I had to photograph it today. And when I first saw it, I saw the the shadows of film noir of the art deco when this camera was made in the 1930s. So what did I did? Come on in right in here and take a look. I've got the 70 to 200 lens on the Nikon Z7 all the way out at 200 with two extension tubes on it to get in closer. You can see I have the Lytra Pro light with the barn doors coming in to give it a side light. Black background, back foreground, and another white card to fill in. Look what happens to the shadows when I put the white card in. So what am I going to do? I'm focusing right here on the front. I'm at F22 ISO 400 and that's giving me a two second exposure. So let's take the picture. You can see I've got manual focus with focus peeking on how the front of the lens is turned red and I'm going to just touch right there and two seconds it's going to take the picture. That's the beauty of what I see here. That's the shapes and line, the uniqueness of this camera. Look at how the shadows play. Because that's what we're doing with photography, is we are writing with light, capturing shadows. Yes, I have a very cool subject here, but now it's up to me to make it art. Let's see what art you can do. Let's see what you can make and how shadows can play in your pictures. Happy Saturday, everybody. Go Dodgers, and let's see your pictures. I'll see you tomorrow for the next day of Be Creative.